This is Sonic, and you're watching JD Frank 20. Ha ha ha! Take this, Sonic Heroes! That's a home run for Dr. Eggman! And it's appropriate since it's baseball season! And then of course Amy gets lo uh, gets separated from her uh, from her friends or quick thinking to uh, come up with an idea to try to meet up with everybody. That was really cool how Amy was able to have that rose petal, uh, turn it into a makeshift snowboard and just to uh, get through the area. That's really cool right there. And then you realize Amy and Tails, uh, they meet up with uh, Sonic and Knuckles and then she she's uh, mad because apparently they're being lazy. I mean, they're realizing like, yeah, they're having fun, but they, they not just realize what just happened right now. They were separated for a short period of time. You know, Amy's taking this very seriously, as she should be. Again, Amy can lead by example. And again, Sonic and Knuckles don't seem to have a problem with it. I mean, they're just, you know, they're just chilled, laid-back dudes. And again, you know, this is one of the primary reasons why Amy should have been the commander in Sonic Forces. Because at least, you know, she's intelligent. She knows what it takes to get the job done. And when you have a buffoon like like Knuckles be in charge, what did you think was going to happen? Again, everybody, let me know what y'all think about this episode. I can't wait for the next part or the finale. I mean, I know this was building for over a month. And I like the fact they're breaking it up into episodes. Keep you in suspense. All right, peace out.